Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. We're going to be reviewing Excalibur by Gottlieb today. Uh, please find our review underneath the description of our YouTube uh, video, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, arcade and pinball talk groups under Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that red subscribe button. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First things first, there's a lot going on on this table. Uh, the art is there. It looks very nice for what it is. Sound bites are pretty funny as far as the horses and, you know, obviously the jousting kind of sounds to the background. Ball speed is actually pretty fast on this. So yeah, artwork seems to be going. It being called Excalibur, I think the theme is, is fitting in that. You got knights in the middle of the play field. Sounds of horses running. This is a uh, three flipper, actually it's a four flipper setup. You got uh, two flipper down, two flippers to the one to the left middle, one to the right middle. And uh, this play field is actually, doesn't flow all the way because you got a block to the middle, which is a ramp. It, it dumps out of that ramp, so if you don't have the speed to go all the way around, it will dump out uh, to the top right side. Uh, in lanes, out lanes, of course, typical. You have an area where underneath the flipper you can get to a uh, lock, a kick, a kick out. Drop targets to the left. You got your first flipper to the middle with a little lane with a rollover. Some drop targets to the back. Uh, some more targets to the back. Ramp to the middle. You also have uh, some more drop targets below it. Another fourth flipper to the right, as well as the lane. And that's pretty much it, minus the targets to the, the lower half of the table, so. Pretty simplistic as far as the setup. That's pretty cool. So uh, obviously uh, when you're shooting through the plunger or getting up to that ramp system, not necessarily a then return it straight to your flippers but uh, it's got a little area there where it directs the ball almost like a train um, so it, it enters the ball to the right and the left and that makes it pretty cool I would say so not too shabby uh, anyway replayability on this is, is, is there because obviously the setup of the table is uh, very different uh, and that adds to the difficulty which makes it more fun so definitely worth a shot if you find this in its uh, physical form mechanically uh, or in its current uh, visual format uh, then absolutely try to find it and play it I think you'll have a blast on this thing it's got it's got a lot going for it so anyway take a take a look at our review under the description and we look forward to our next video with you guys thank you again for watching today